New camera, what do you think? Focus? Focus? And then a real quick flip around. I think it's good. Our grill is absolutely disgusting. It came with the RV, and when it came with the RV, it was disgusting. And I see a lot of RVers actually use these gr exact grills, but they put foil over it so that you don't have to put a nasty, greasy grill underneath your RV every time you move. Back on the roof, back on the roof. I very much highly recommend this little Netgear router repeater. I'm not sure what you call it. It's the Trek N300 or something like that. Basically a Swiss Army knife of routers. It can convert a public Wi-Fi into a secured private Wi-Fi. It can extend the range of a Wi-Fi network. It can convert Wi-Fi into Ethernet. It can convert, oh, Lawrence pressing the button. It can convert Ethernet into Wi-Fi. Basically, anything you want to do with the internet, it can do it in this tiny little box. But the strength is not great, but what would you really expect out of a little box this big? Ready? Go! Oh, nice job. I think this was overdue for a cleaning. I took the propane bottle out. That's crazy. That's dangerous. Can you just turn that back on? I'm gonna turn the heat off. Yeah, this 30 amp breaker is just not enough to run our heat in the RV. It keeps flipping. Flipped in the middle of the night last night. I had to come and get it. Well, it's not the brand new look I was going for, but it is squeaky clean now, and it won't self-combust. I was wondering, 6.9 miles per gallon. Okay, here we go again. Let's see what kind of space we've got in here. I'm assuming it's this big long one on the right. This campground is pretty pricey at $46 a night, but it was the only one that would fit our size, so here we are. But, benefit, it has great Wi-Fi everywhere, and it even has a little cable TV connection, so I've never used it, but we have a cable TV input here on our RV. We thought we were long. Guy's got, uh, oh, here he comes through. This is called an HDR conversion or something like that. It's where you take a semi, you buy one like a really high mileage semi, and then you cut off one of the axles and then put a gooseneck hitch on it. So you have temporary living quarters up in the front and the sleeper, and then obviously just ridiculous towing capacity. And these are used to towing 80,000 pounds. It's pretty sweet. This is Walmart. Going on. I just like take over an old industrial building or something. Now we have to figure out which wire in here is the one that runs to the back there. I had to break out the big guns for this one. This is what's called a toner. On this end, I've got a little device here that generates a tone and puts that tone into the wire. And then this end, I press the button and kind of feel around in here until I hear a tone. I hear it pretty good on that one. Let's open that one up. Winner, winner. Now we plug this end from the cable into our HD home run. It's a little TV tuner, but instead of going over USB, it goes over your network so you can watch it on any device in your house. Come on, come on, come on. Tuner did not detect any channels. Darn it. We used the washing machine in the RV, but the dryer doesn't work, so we are now walking over to the laundry to dry our sheets. And I thought we could use this opportunity to talk a little bit about what Lark thinks of our whole situation. We have not really <laughs> kept up our end of the bargain because we're kind of shifting gears. So I did have a chance to talk with them, and as usual, they're super cool, laid back, whatever, go with the flow said if there weren't bumps along the way, then it wouldn't be worth doing or something like that, something encouraging. So there's great to work with. Yes. Uh, I did have concerns about mentioning them in these vlogs as a sponsor because I didn't know if they wanted to be associated with all the trouble that we're having, <laughs> <laughs> but they- Trouble that doesn't have anything to do with <laughs> no. the trailer itself though. And they said, no, that's no problem. So we'll plug a lark a little bit here for the next few vlogs. It is 25 cents per six minutes. We only have six quarters. All right, here goes. Well, the cable didn't work, but we got all the same channels over the antenna anyway. Finish up the day with an upload, some Narcos, and then tomorrow we go and see Izzy. Yay! Very excited. Yes, very. We'll see you then. Bye.